how long did you have me sleep? Oh, good morning, sunshine. It's about time you woke up. Well, why don't you wake I me up earlier you might then? might need some rest, so. Oh. I'm not sure exactly how long it's been, but uh, sun is pretty high up. Are you hungry? I've been cooking up the meat. I hope you don't mind. I just picked it out of your backpack. Here, you just pop yourself. You want chicken or beef? You know, I think I'm in the mood for some beef. Yeah? Fine with me. I'm going to take the chicken. I don't know. We've had that beef for a couple of days, you know? Or, no, how long has it been? Um, it's Shit, only I don't been, even remember where we killed the cow. Um, it's only been a night. Tell me what you see, if anything. Okay, so I, I see the town down there, and... I mean, it looks pretty quiet. I'm not seeing anybody uh, walking around, so... Obviously, it's not like Zelenogorsk or... What the fuck did he call that town? Hollywood? Kind of a really fucked up name for it, but whatever. <laughs> well, you know, it's not like anyone else is using the name Hollywood anymore. And, not exactly um, copyright, but... You know, from this distance, it almost looks like a... Like there's a runway over there. Like, um... Hmm. You see any planes? Um, it's too far away, but I'm not seeing anything right now. Might be worth taking a look at. Imagine we can find like a helicopter or something. <laughs> Not that I have any fucking clue how to fly it, but still be kind of cool. I mean, I've already said I have the. Uh, I mean, I. I only learned a little bit how to fly, so. It really, um, really wouldn't be really uh, a good idea. Even if there was a, uh, a plane or a helicopter. I mean, if you oh, had to fly, worry. you gotta fly, but... I wouldn't but... fly with you even if you had 10 years of experience. Oh, that's really comforting, Bill. Oh, by the way, you might want to pick up your box again. You might need something else to keep the meat in in the future, you know, if you find any other animal. Um, yeah, good idea. Not like we really want to, um, leave any sign of us being here. I mean, there's really not much we can do about this campfire, but... Hmm. Anyone could have left the campfire. No one's gonna follow us this way. I mean, this is a pretty high point. It's a tactical advantage, you know. I imagine anyone could have the idea to camp out here. Hmm. Alright, so we have uh, three things we can do. We can go to that town. We can check out what appears to be an airfield. and um, Or we could uh, follow that road south. It's up to you. Hmm. I'm not sure I'm up for going into town right now, to be honest. Maybe we should just follow the road. See where it takes us. Maybe eventually head west. Yeah, um... I, I like the sound of that plane. Let's, um... Let's get going. Yep. Cars. 
Yeah. I don't suppose we could fix any of them up. Looks like they've been stripped for parts already. To be honest, I think this place, um... Maybe the person who lived here might have, um... I mean, I don't know if they have this in Norway, but... There was a lot of, um, places uh, in the backwoods where people would get a bunch of old, broken cars. And they would strip them for parts. Are you kidding me? I lived in the, the part of Norway where everyone did that. Oh, so that was well, not a thing everyone, over there? but it was pretty fucking common. Oh yeah, definitely. You know, you'd have a couple of hicks living out on the countryside. They'd basically buy any wreck they could. You know, cheap as fuck. Strip it for parts and use all the different parts and fix up one of them, and then they just sell it, or they just use it to drive around in the fields. You know. Yeah, I kind of wonder, though, um, what backwoods hick would, uh, have a garden? A what? A garden. I mean, look at this. There's, um, uh, what are these, sunflowers? Um, pumpkins? Um, and yet there's also a bunch of broken down cars. Hmm. Well, maybe someone set up here, you know, after it all, all happened. And they kept hauling vehicles back, you know, to keep getting supplies. Could explain some things. There's a lot of fucking junk out here. Well, is this a fucking washing machine? Some hubcap. Fucking garbage. You know, either whoever lived here before was a real fucking mess, or, uh... Someone's been living here since. Yeah, I suppose at the end of the but world... I don't imagine um, anyone just throwing garbage around in the old days. Yeah, I think um, nowadays uh, staying uh, cleanly isn't really on the uh, to-do list for a lot of people. Yeah. I'm gonna go take a look in the woods just to uh get familiar with the area i don't know maybe there's something else down there you just uh hang back keep safe i'll be back soon okay uh just be safe all right will do Ava! Ava! I saw someone. What? What's the problem, Bill? I saw someone down a hill. Um... With the fire, I saw... I saw a guy. What, what, what do you want to do about it? Let's, let's stay quiet and stay low. Okay, okay. my back. I'm gonna stay hidden as long as you can, okay? I'm gonna walk up to him and see what the hell he's doing here. Okay, hold on, hold on. I see him as well. Um... Oh. Okay, I'm going to, uh, come on his left side. So, um, it, it's safer if I come from behind him, okay? Got it. I'm gonna move down with the tree line. See if I can get the jump on. Alright. Um... I should probably head out first. Yeah, just go over. Buddy. Be careful, okay? Don't let him see you. 